Real Steve TV brings you C. What is it? C of. I already forgot. Sword. The Sword in the Moon. C Cove Light Studios. Now, traveler, let your adventure begin. Back to Sea of Dreams. Star stars. Sea of Stars has two main characters. Select the one who will lead the party. This can be changed later and does not affect the story. Okay. I'm going to be the dude. She's cool too, but I'm going to be the dude. A blade dancer born on the summer solstice walks the path of the guardian god Solon. A monk born on the winter solstice walks the path of the guardian goddess Luana. No, we're going with Zale, dude. He's my boy. He's going to be the star of this show, folks. So, I mean, I'm sure all you guys love, like, the original Final Fantasy style game. I know I do. And I've been feeling like a classic turn-based, like I said, so we'll, we'll see. I'm in interested. No way! That was awesome! So the, the weeb in me is going to really come out, and I'm ashamed to say it, but I have a 10% weeb in me. Yeah, what a ride. The Elder Mist wasn't kidding. So the eclipse will happen soon, but we're no closer to Wraith Island. I doubt we'll find a ship at this altitude. To ground level? Th Dude, should I do the full characters, different voices? Oh, this is where Archmagus actually shines. To ground level, then! Only one way to go from here anyway! Traversing the world is a tactile experience. Indeed it is. <clears throat> As it is in real life. You can hoist up or jump off of most ledges with X. You can also use X to cling to climbable surfaces. That is a shame. Dude, I want to get into tactile experiences, dude. Okay, uh, mm-hmm. I'm gathering. Indeed he does. I love the art style. That I'm a sucker for the art style, man. Real Steve TV. This game's easy. Ooh, there's some baddies down there, dude. And not the kind you meet in the club. Okay. Well, we're gonna start off nice and easy with just some regular old attacks. We'll check the skills out next. And I'm gonna pick the guy that's closer to me. I don't know if that has any effect on it. Oh, he's vulnerable. Big time. Let's try it. Let's try a skill. Oh no, let's do... She's a mage, I think, so she's not gonna have anything really cool for attack, but we're going to try attacks first. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Die. Let's see what this guy's all about. Alright, now, okay, we did an attack with each character. So I, I think the chubby guy with the shield is a warrior. She's a mage. I don't know what he would be like classified as, but maybe a rogue? Let me know in the comments if you know. Healing light. Oh yeah. Sunball. Oh yeah. She needs a heal, dude. Dude, it's got that 80s. Fighting bad guys in the name of the law. Moonerang. Lunar magic projectile that can bounce to multiple targets. Crescent smashes enemy in an arc. Let's, let's gonna go a little AoE here, folks. Press X to deflect. Oh, I get it. Uh, did I have to deflect that spell off of... The bad guy? Okay. And let's see what this chubby guy can do. Garl hurls an enemy to another position. 
Who all throws a snack at a friend? No, let's just attack then, dude. I don't... No, I don't like that. Yeah, so she's a mage. <laughs> I can see that very well. What's all that stuff? First battle. Initiated. Completed. Defeated. So what's up this cute cutie? Oh, what's up this cutie? <sighs> All anime style. <sighs> Just the nutrition we needed. Question mark lady. She's the rogue, dude. In the port town of Brisk, a pirate crew promises to get them to Wraith Island in time for the eclipse on one condition. He better not ask us to do something illegal, is what I'm saying. It's not like you have other options. Still making a deal with pirates? They seem nice enough to me. Okay. All right, here goes nothing. All right, I don't want to talk to everybody right now. You know how these RPGs are, dude. Knath Knathan. Well, look who it is. You're all in the voice acting is super annoying. Um, anyways, that come the voice acting comes free with the channel, folks. The deal stands. If you can't beat Veltrade at arm wrestling, we got an item that needs fetching. After which, Pirate's Honor will take y'all to Wraith Island. We're getting in bed with these guys. What do you say? Everybody, arm wrestling battle. I'll trade you up. Oh no, we're gonna get into an arm wrestling match with these guys, with these vagabonds. I'll do it, you guys are too strong, it wouldn't be fair. Plus arm wrestling, a real pirate, how cool is that? Fine, but go easy on the poor fella. Got it, Valer. I'll be your challenger. I'm your huckleberry. Captain Cliche. Uh, play on words. Go all out, we can't leave without it. Yo, that's a girl. Hey, hey Cap, aye aye, aye aye, Captain. Right, tough one. You look like ready on three. Is this a mini game or what, what's going on? Two, three. That was aggressive. Steroids. Steroids. I'm sorry, did I miss the part where we agreed on a no magic shirt rule? Steroids. Sorry, pal. Captain's orders. Are you kidding? That was awesome. He liked it. This will be my best anecdote for sure. Show me again. You're lucky we didn't ask about specifics. Should have negotiated when you had a chance, son. This lesson's on the house. Haha, <laughs> Valtrade is truly good at everything. Now, since you lost the arm wrestling challenge, how about we discuss this little errand? It's a powerful token. Paying an undead creature with it forces them to do one's bidding. Satanism? I will use it to redacted for spoilers. Uh, is that because it's the demo or is that because they're being cute? The redacted for spoilers part. Fine, how do we get in? Fear is what people kept people away all this time, but you look like you can handle yourselves in battle. <sighs> we can. I've been playing video games for 35 years. I'm not afraid of an abandoned arcane wizards. You know what I mean? My crew won't fight, but they'll get you inside. Oh yeah. Key Nathan, a bit of magic should do the trick. Drug usage. I, sh I shall open the way to the abandoned wizard lab or my name is not Knathan. <laughs> okay, dude. Oh, holy captain, ain't you coming with? I will stay here and make preparations for our departure. Fetch the coin of undeath accord, then meet me at the docks. Yolande, Beltrade, and Knathan join the cargo. I will stay here and make preparations for our departure. Good. Good. I like when their dialogue is the is the last thing they said. It's like, let's keep it, you know, keep the storyline, you know, and especially me, 
I forget easy, so let's keep it on track. Don't say some random thing to confuse me. If you want to hear a spooky story, just light a campfire and I'll join you. Join you. I'm okay. I'm telling you, I saw it with my own eyes. It was less than 100 yards in front of my ship. Oh yeah, well it was less than 10 yards from my ship once. Drinking. So guys, this has a high mature rating. So we've seen drug usage, drinking, steroids. It's pretty hardcore game. I was on a trip to Lusa once and they also had stools to sit on. Drunk. Most places do, sir. Twice on the same side is how I do it. Sexual stuff now, great. Twice on the same side is how I do it. Guys, if you have kids, make sure you vet this one. I'm, I'm doing it for you. So I wouldn't, this is M17 plus game. Easy. Let's get to the mission at hand, dude. We're going to, whoa, you can swim, dude. It's very tactile. Paywall. You're also demo. <laughs> Found a seashell. Dude, I love the art style. I'm a sucker for cute little characters. I just love the salt in there. I do too. I do too, sir. Welcome, were you looking for new equipment? Oh yeah. What do you have here? Rock lid? Power belt? So that's weird. Does it, this power belt, does none of those characters can wear it? Ooh, well, what do we have here? What do we have here? Oh, this is where the fun begins. I wonder if you can't equip stuff because it's the demo, you know? I just got an upgrade and I would enjoy using it. What a charming game. My characters are sort of like the bad boys of this game, so... That one guy's missing an eye. Dude, he get, he gets down, dude. Uh... Already lost. All, all good. I didn't... I don't remember where they said to go. Real steep TV. Okay, I actually really like the game thus far. Dude, I love the art style. Cute, charming. I love the colors. Bright. You know what I mean? Like, upbeat, happy. The soundtrack, dude, I don't know the way it's on, just, I don't know. Did you hear what happened at the Humble Boast? Yeah, 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 we we did, we were there. Um, that lady is on steroids. Um, apologies, this area is off limits for the demo. Paywall, am I lost on level one? A child's game? A game fit for a child, dude? I don't think you can equip anything. That makes my heart hurt. You guys know how I feel about gearing up, so I want to get into another battle though. Just let's, let's we gotta get safe journeys and don't forget to time your hits and blocks. If combat is giving you a hard time, maybe activate that relic you have. Easy mode, I, sir. I don't need a relic. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Now we're in the open world. I told you guys I'd figure it out. So let's check the open world. Love it. Do I love it? Yeah, it's very cute. Fishing basics. Press X to cast. Casting is always at full power. While airborne, steer the bobber with L and press X to kick it into the water. If the bobber touches water close to a fish, it's a hook. While hook, steer the fish with L and press X and hold to reel while it's in the zone. Be careful not to reel outside of the zone, otherwise the line will break. Reel the fish all the way to the dock and it's catch. Did I miss? Um, if you've watched my channel for any length of time, you know how I feel about fishing in video games. I don't like it.
I don't like it at all. One bit, sir. Get it. Get him. It's a whopper, Mom. You caught a man of war. Like a true natural. Um, I was playing Darkest Dungeon, and I also love the art style in that game. But, like, games like that and Elden Ring, that vibe and ambiance of just dark, like, really does get to me. You know, after being in a environment or world like that, it gets, it gets to me. But games like this with the bright, vibrant colors and stuff, I, I love that, dude. I'm an artist, so, like, I love bright colors and just shades of color. Um, so when games are all vibrant like this, I love it. That is really cool. That's cu that's cute. All right, here's the abandoned arcane wizard's laboratory. The wizard died years ago. We don't know how. We're going to get to the bottom of it. Thank you.